A warm good morning to all of you. I, Dr. Robin Chopra, Assistant Professor in Department of Physiotherapy at RPIIT Institute of Medical Sciences, Village Pistada, Karnal. I welcome you all in our YouTube channel that is RPIIT Academics. But before watching, please don't forget to like, subscribe, share and hit the bell icon. So let's start the topic. So as in previous class, we already discussed about neck pain and now we are coming to the next topic that is how a neck pain differs and there are some different types of neck pain starting from first that is neuropathic neck pain as it is a stemming from the nerves or nerve roots in the cervical spine and neuropathic neck pain could result from conditions such as herniated disc that presses against a nearby nerve or other cause of nerve compression. Then second type of neck pain is mechanical neck pain as this pain stems from the spine and its supporting structures. For example, there are some muscles, ligaments, bones or cartilage which causes the pain. Typically the mechanical pain is caused by poor posture mainly in the household wives or job sitting workers. And neck strain caused by work or supporting or any physical activities cause stress and even stress plays a major role in mechanical neck pain. So coming to the third type of neck pain that is central neuropathic pain. Most commonly a result of a stroke, spinal cord injury or multiple sclerosis. It may also be a result of injury to the central nervous system which is most commonly caused by traumatic injury to the brain, spinal cord or infection resulting in the formation of abscesses or the conditions like encephalitis or myelitis then coming to the next topic that is what are the symptoms of cervical pain so there are mainly six symptoms related to the cervical pain that is first is stiff neck or straight neck which is caused by due to the muscle spasm then second is headache. Headache may be either in the resting position or headache due to postural changes. Then third is numbness. Numbness either may be localized or generalized. In localized mainly the area which is situated over the cervical part and mainly in the neck area and generalized which means which covers the surrounding areas mainly upper back and the shoulder areas then fourth is weakness weakness of the muscle occurs due to the prolonged tension state of the muscles and muscles now become shortened in straight and resulting in a stiff or straight neck then fifth is sharp pain sharp pain either may be of four types either it is a sharp shooting pain or maybe a burning sensation pain or maybe a pins and needle sensation pain then it may be a tingling sensation pain and the last one is journal soreness there may be a journal soreness or around the areas which is most commonly affected mainly over the cervical vertebras so guys hope so you all understand very well and for more information please stay tuned stay healthy happy till then take care goodbye and please don't forget to subscribe this channel.